Hello, I'm Cy Robertson, and this is the UNH Fairchild Dairy Teaching and Research Center. Hey, how's it going? I'm Colton Dow, a dairy major at UNH, <clears throat> and a member of the UNH Dairy Club. UNH offers a lot for dairy students, including the Dairy Club, the Cream Program, and several other dairy classes. The Thompson School also offers hands-on experience in the dairy world. Cream, dairy cattle diseases, dairy cattle selection, nutrition, animal breeding, agriculture today, out of those classes, which one did you like the most and why? I like cream the most. Why did you like cream? Cream is a beneficial class and where I already knew a lot about the actual animal part. I learned a lot about how to work with other people and how to use communication skills to bring several people together to accomplish a common goal. I wish I said that more fluently, but yeah, cream. Cooperative Real Experience in Agriculture Management is a class where 30 or so students work together at the Fairchild Dairy, milk and do chores for the Holstein herd here in Durham. I have nothing else to say. putting down mine where it absorbs some of the moisture where the cow's udder is. In this cart, you will wheel down the aisle and spread out shavings like this. And on this end of the barn, you can see one creamer here scraping out of their stalls, getting ready to bed for when the cows come back from the parlor. And I think that's Gina wailing up on the data ranger, mixing a load of feed for the high diet. He's just getting ready to put down some more feed. But before we do that, we always pick up the orange, the leftover feed from yesterday. So here Gina is shuffling it back into the data ranger. Here at UNH, we have about 10 ingredients in our cow's diets. Here you can see two, alfalfa and straw. Our next two ingredients are blood meal, which you can see here, and energy mix, a mixture of sweet corn, pelleted grain, and other high energy materials. Materials, nutrients, maybe that would not sound too much. I feel like this is not a good view. Let's walk down here because I feel like that's cooler to look at. Here in H for forage, we feed a corn silage, which is here packed in this bunker, and and a beautiful, nice grass silage. Hay silage is our other forage that we feed to our lactating dairy cows and all our other animals here at the Fairchild Dairy Center. This is our calf barn here at UNH. As our cows calve, we move our calves from the maternity pen with our cows to these individual pens where we can keep them clean, warm, dry, and healthy. We have capacity for about 20 calves inside here. And once we feed them milk for several weeks, they're then moved outside. As our calves get older and they're weaned off milk, we move them from our calf barn to these hutches where they begin to be socialized. This is our milking parlor. We milk in a double five herring bone. These are some creamers from this year. Lindsay, Adam, and Katie conversing, of course, about cream.
Hey Lindsay. Hi Golden. How's milking going today? So far so good. How long does it take to milk out a unage dairy cow? <laughs> How long? Four to six minutes. That's fast. Why did Center and they hold fundraisers, but they're off school right now. Um, basically, what you do is you work in one of the food groups during the hockey game, and they said that they would keep us in mind, um, but it would take a group. This is a movie. This, this, this is a move. This is a movie. You and H Dairy Club on tour. I'm gonna drive this thing right now. Hey, well, well, we have a young answer. family in the wagon. I would say <laughs> when we get back, you can uh, let her drive it in a little circle. Bro. So you could swim the river and go have a pizza. Yeah. Bed. Well, no, if you well, you gotta swim a different river than this one. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, is this river swimmable? I mean, yeah, I swim in it all yeah. the time anyway. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I mean, it's swimmable. Stuck on you and they bring you. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so what do we do now? <laughs> um, Follow the cavalry. All right. So let's get out and get a picture, Natalie. Okay, <laughs> I, I'm still taking a video though. I got it right when we popped the tire. It was lovely. <laughs> Can I learn how to drive it now? Since it's not working. Why do you think it would go well? <laughs> I don't know. Like just before you go down in the, you know, puddle. Go back up. Now you can get a picture of us driving away. Okay? Wait, 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 wait. <laughs> Here, Natalie. Oh, nice. Natalie can get a moving video. Dude. We're good to Okay, go. we're good, Nate. Yeah, easy does. <laughs> Don't forget to look out for trees, by the way. Always. Always. <laughs> Stop. He's leaving without us. Oh, no, it just took, oh, no, you're good. Got it. This is your name. 